Erythema multiforme. Okay, so we will use the mnemonic of E, M, and F. So, everything important that you need to know regarding this condition or this kind of skin disease is in the mnemonic E, M, F. Let's use the letters. So, epidemiology, it's more common in males, especially in the early middle age, 20 years to 40 years of age. Um, what's the mechanism? It's an immunologic problem or an immunologic reaction. Most probably it's a type 4 hypersensitivity reaction. And remember type 4 is lymphocytes, which we will discuss later, but keep this in mind. Okay, what are the causes? A lot. Okay, from the infectious um, organism, we have the herpes simplex and the mycoplasma. Very important. Herpes and mycoplasma. Okay, drugs can cause erythema multiforme, including penicillins and sulfonamides, drugs that contain sulfa. Also, malignancy may be associated with erythema multiforme. Okay, describe the lesion. Multiple, centripetal, symmetric, Target-like legions consists of macules, it's edematous, sometimes there are hemorrhagic crass, crusts, also it affects the mucous membrane, so you can find it on the lips of the patient. Okay, okay, so maybe you feel confused, so let's highlight the crucial parts. You have to remember IgM, autoantibodies. You have to remember herpes simplex and mycoplasma. Okay, you have to remember that it's type 4 hypersensitivity reaction. Okay, also, this disease affects the palms and the soles. Okay, there are certain diseases or certain skin conditions that affect the palms and the soles. They are very important for your exam okay one of them is erythema multiforme okay so here is a palm with multiple legions on the palm okay so let's describe the rash it's a target like legion consists of three distinct uh, regions the center is erythematous and sometimes it can be crusty or vesicular. Then it's surrounded by a pale edematous ring. And at the end you have the erythematous border. So, erythematous center, then pale edematous ring, then erythematous border on the outside. Here are the legions of mycoplasma, of, sorry, of erythema multiforme, which can be associated with mycoplasma. Okay, so let's do some biopsy. If you do biopsy, skin biopsy, you'll find lymphocytes. Okay, if you take some blood for lab, you'll find eosinophils. All right, so how to treat this disease? The disease is very self-limited, okay? Also, you can use topical steroids for this legions, erythema multiforme, erythema multiforme, EMF, you got it. Please subscribe for new videos every single week.